Well, I'll tell you one thing, when it comes to football season, I got a full day. Come down right here. Let him have it. Oh, the draft, baby. Coaching football is my, you know, that's my passion. Right here, right here, right here. Boom, let it go. I enjoy being out there in front of those young kids each and every day. Use your hands, not your pad. It's a full-time job. Here we go, defense! Hey, hey. I'm making a difference in a young person's life, and that's important to me. We got one week to correct our mistakes. We got to make it happen. All right, it starts tomorrow. We're going to come out here. Probably the biggest experience I've had with Monroe it had something to do with my health. I had prostate cancer. I researched it out, went to Jacksonville, went to Orlando, went to Tampa to get the, the best advice I could get. I had to make a good sound decision that I was gonna live with for hopefully another 30 years. But when it all boiled down to making a good sound decision, I was right back at Monroe with Dr. Tobb and having the procedure done there. They gave me the best option I felt like due to all the research that my family did. The Da Vinci robotic surgery, you know, just an unbelievable process that I went through. I'll go in on a Wednesday, I'm out on a Thursday, I'm walking my neighborhood on Friday night, and back to work a half a day on Monday. So that's critical for me. As I, as I said, I've got a full-time job, and I've got a young daughter and got a young son that needs me and a, and a lovely wife, but I also got 82 kids out here at Trinity Catholic that are looking at me every day. So, so I can't be down long, and that surgery at Monroe was outstanding. I had to make a good decision and Monroe was the right decision for me. I think we're very fortunate. I know there's a lot of great medical facilities around the country, but when you got it in your backyard and you're five minutes away from your home uh, and you got the quality right there in your backyard, uh, I took advantage of it. I'm John Brantley, a cancer survivor, and Monroe's my hospital.